Okay, when you're working with Dexter, he is always on your left hand side. Sometimes he doesn't do a perfect heel. I've not been real particular about that. My main goal has been that Dexter walks with me and goes with me when I want him. So I'm just like Dexter heel. The leash is loose. We're just out for a walk. If he doesn't pay attention, I do give him a little snap with the training collar. Because, I mean, he's supposed to pay attention to where I am. Good boy. Good boy. Good. Sit. And he's not the best at sitting when he stops. Good boy. I've not been real particular with it either. My main goal has been that he's just calm, you know, listens, stay. Now we're going to approach another dog and the cat wasn't as cooperative. It wanted to keep moving around, but we're going to try the dog. And let me just show you, he's not used to this dog. So this is all new. Dexter Hill. Sit. Stay. And he's, as you see, he's observing the horses, but no barking. I mean, it's fine for him to be nosy about stuff, but he doesn't need to be talking about it. Dexter, heel. When I say heel, he's ready to go. And like I say, he'll go a little bit and just give him a little quick correction if he's pulling on you with that slip chain. You cannot hurt him. Now, if he were to be barking at somebody, I make the slip chain sound like a zipper. You don't keep it tight all the time, you just jerk it like that. No, sit. Good boy. And you want to be real firm, but clear what you mean. Good boy, Dexter. Heel. Dexter, come. Good boy, Dexter. That was a nice sit. Heel. And the ground's cold too. Sit. Sit. Stay. Boy. Dexter, come. Good boy, Dexter. 